guys welcome back to another episode of six adventure cooking today we are gonna make corned beef patty yes mr corned beef patty so i want you guys to stay tuned and watch we are going in another kitchen here all right all right guys so i'm gonna get the flour ready for going inside of the pan i'm gonna put at least three cups of the flour inside of the pan if we think we need more, I will put another one. So that's one, two, and this a three. All right, we're going to put one, one more. That's four. All right. Okay, so I have some warm water right here, so, so I'm going to put the yeast inside of it. Reason for that is that heat activate yeast. Now guys, I'm going to add some baking powder. I'm going to add some salt. And then I'm gonna add some butter. Right. So guys, I'm gonna combine the butter and the um the flour together. Make sure everything inside. Guys, yeah, so I already combined the flour and the butter together. So you see how it kind of look like breadcrumbs. That's the kind of texture we may look for. So then now I'm going to add um, the water with the yeast inside of it. And then I'm going to show you what's going on. So stay tuned. So guys, this is the water with the yeast. So I'm going to add it to the flour. Alright. And then I'm going to combine all of that together. Right, guys, so just stay tuned and watch your go on. Guys, don't be afraid to get your hand dirty and get all of in that flour. Combine everything. Right? Make sure it's nice. So I don't need this now. I'm going to put it down and make it go on rice for a little bit. Then I'm going to cook up the, um, the corned beef. And let me show you how I go on. All right, guys, so just stay tuned and watch the process. All right, guys, so now I'm going to cook up the corn slash corn beef. All right, guys, so just stay tuned and watch the process. So now I'm going to add a little bit of oil. And then we're gonna come in again with the the vegetables. Alright. Remember I tell you guys that um I add my vegetables in the oil before it gets hot because once the oil hot, you know say the oil I will splash up so we don't want that. Right, so now I'm gonna add my seasoning. Some 
put that in the two hats. Mm -hmm. Alright. And then we'll mix that up here now. So now I'm going to add the corned beef inside. Alright. I'm gonna make this go and cook down a little bit and then we're gonna add my canned corn inside of it as well. So guys just stay tuned. Okay guys, so now I'm gonna add a bit of ketchup. Gonna mix that in. Got a bit of mess. All right. Let that go and simmer down a little bit, and then maybe add the can of corn inside. So stay tuned, guys. pretty and nice all right guys so the next thing we're going to show you is how the flour is looking right now all right guys so stay tuned and watch our one okay guys so now i'm gonna add my canned corn i know i said i was gonna show you the flour but i'm gonna add the corn first all right guys so just take a look Alright, so I'm gonna take out the time. Alright. Alright guys, so you see the flower now? Oh it come big and it rise up. This is what I'm looking for. So now I'm gonna go get everything ready so that we can put the corned beef on top of it and then put it in the oven. So guys just stay tuned and watch you have one. Alright? This is what I'm looking for. Nice, nice door. Smooth, fluffy. See that? Nice and fluffy. Alright, guys. I'm going to sprinkle a little flour on that. Carry it over. Get the door. Here 
mix it. This so I'm gonna roll it out. Hey okay, guys, so just stay tuned and watch your one. Now I'm gonna add the corned beef. Alright, so then we're gonna close up that bad boy now. What I'm going to do, I'm going to add some water around the rim so that it can close, right? So guys, just stay tuned. I'm going to use a fork now to get that nice pretty design make it look like a patty. And then I put two holes on top right, so that the steam can come up. Alright guys, so just stay tuned and watch what I want. As you can see guys i'm finished so then i'm gonna put it in the oven to bake and then i will show you guys the finished results so just stay tuned and watch our one guys so this is what it's currently looking like now so when it's finished i'll show you the finished product 